This is the Crown Plaza Hotel. Although it looks like a set from X-Men. And this is where the shoot starts today for the travel channel called Baggage Wars. Oh, sorry. Baggage Battle. I always want to call it Baggage Wars. Baggage Battle. I'm waiting to meet the New Yorker by the name of Cindy. Hey, this is the Indiana Convention Center. It'll tell you the time and what the temperature is. And I'm showing you this. Because I wanted to show you this. <laughs> that is the Marriott. They didn't just wrap the Marriott. They lit the Marriott. And everybody says, that's so cool. That is the most exciting thing about what they've done to that building. So, thank you, Mr. Marriott. It's really funny. Okay, this is the inside of Lucas Oil Stadium. It feels like a movie theater in here, all nice and warm. And they have a really spanky floor. This is just the entryway. This is the Missouri Street Red Zone. You can't see it. Entryway. And I'm waiting for Trina to come with my credentials, which is the tag that everybody is wearing. Like my friend here. Oh. Okay, Trina told me to uh, go see the field. I've never seen the thing before. I marched at the Hoosier Dome, and now I will be setting up all the <laughs> for this. Lucas Stadium, guys! Oh my god, there's a field double charge! And another double charge? That goes all the way across the thing! Wow! There's Charles the Trina! Trina! You are in charge of one brick Indianapolis for the Super Bowl. Trina, tell us about these fancy, fancy, expiring passes. These tags are awesome. There's little pink stripes. You can maybe see them throughout the day. They will turn red, and then you can't get them. Maybe more. And this is the beautiful welcoming committee from Santa Rosa who gives out free hugs and kisses. Say hi, guys. Get this stuff. This is a boost phone. Yeah, well, it's for boost. It's the Southern California. Close up. Okay, Trina, can you tell us how this one day is going to make the entire yearly budget? for One Brick Indianapolis 2012. Yes. Uh, BBA and the NFL are giving us $40 per volunteer that we get to actually show up. Uh, it takes about two to $3,000 per chapter uh, a year to run. Uh, so this should net us between four and $5,000. So it will support us for an entire year, save us a lot of grant writing time and a lot of begging. And One Brick does what? This is the Hayes and Sons suite at Lucas Oil Stadium, and I really like it because it has the coziness of a TV dinner. You come back here, you get your snacks. They've all been put out by the exact specifications because we are at the Patriot area of the field, and you can come over here and get your snack, come right over here and watch the game, except being on the TV is live in front of your face. And then you can also go and talk to your neighbor. Go, hey, you like that play? Yeah, I like that play. And they also have specially made... This is a 50-yard line suite uh, at the Lucas Oil Stadium, which is beautiful. Um, it is on mid-level. And the press have just arrived and have started to take the field. Look at that! And I want to let you guys know that in every suite there are official places where the stuff is put. This is a view from the Kiplish Lanham Investments Suite at Lucas Oil Stadium. This is one of my favorite kinds of suites because it's got three platinum plasmas and um, there's the Stella, fully stocked bar for your wieners and stuff. And then you can come over here and sit and watch the game right through the goal line. Woo! Nice. If you're going to watch a game, that's a good spot. Yeah.
This is the Lucas Fleet at Lucas Oil Stadium. It has jerseys on the wall and a big giant, I'm guessing, an NFL book. We, at One Brick Indianapolis, are putting seat cushions on every seat, including the suites, uh, at the Super Bowl. Jimmy Fallon's probably going to be up here, and his butt's going to be sitting on this cushion right here. And this is the horseshoe-shaped wet bar. For those of you not invited to the Lucas Suite at Lucas Oil Stadium, you might end up perhaps at the bar at the Lesser Suite with a really nice view. There's no Stella Artois in this one. Okay, this is the top of Lucas Oil Stadium, and it is the Super Bowl in I helped pay for the stadium, I just found out. You can go to Wikipedia and figure it out. Uh, it is beautiful. Those are the nosebleed seats, my friends. And that is the ceiling that retracts. And I gotta say, I'm happy with how my tax money got spent. So, thank you, Engineers, for making such a beautiful place.